Meghan Markle recently enjoyed a ski vacation with her close friends Kelly McKee Zajfin and Heather Dorick. The Duchess of Sussex was seen smiling alongside Dorick, who owns a Pilates business, and Zajfin, a former model, as they hit the slopes of Powder Mountain in Utah. The trio bundled up in warm coats, gloves, sunglasses, and beanie hats, and Dorick even shared pictures of her family members who joined them on the trip. This ski getaway comes just two weeks after Meghan and Prince Harry were spotted skiing in Whistler, Canada, to commemorate the one-year countdown to the next Invictus Games. Dorick, the founder of Pilates Platinum, expressed her joy on Instagram, describing the trip as perfect and expressing gratitude for their wonderful friends. Zajfin also shared the photo on her Instagram, expressing her appreciation for the amazing friends and the memorable adventures they shared. Megan and Zajfin have a close friendship, and Zajfin is the co-founder of the Alliance of Moms Group, which offers support to pregnant and parenting teenagers in the foster care system in Los Angeles. Zajfin has praised Megan as an incredible friend and mother, emphasizing her unwavering support and willingness to be there for loved ones. Doric, on the other hand, attended Meghan and Harry's wedding in 2018 and owns multiple Pilates studios in California. Following the Whistler trip, Meghan made a virtual appearance in northwest London to inaugurate a new wing of the Mayhew Vet Clinic. This event was publicized on the Sussex.com website, which Meghan and Harry launched together. However, the website sparked controversy due to its prominent royal branding. Additionally, a video surfaced showing Meghan cooking traditional Afghan food with a group of Afghan women who resettled in the U.S., although this was from a previous visit to the Southern California Welcome Project. In a legal battle, Harry recently lost his high court challenge against the Home Office regarding a decision to change his level of personal security during UK visits. Harry expressed his intention to appeal the ruling after taking legal action against the government department over a decision made in February 2020 to provide him with a different degree of taxpayer-funded protection while in Britain. Thank you, amazing fans. I am utterly overwhelmed by the incredible support and love you have shown me on this YouTube journey. Your unwavering dedication, countless views, and uplifting comments have been the fuel that keeps me going. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. If you haven't subscribed yet, now is the perfect time. By hitting that subscribe button, you'll gain access to even more exciting content, exclusive updates, and the latest news.